Hey, I'm in Sicily today and this is a small island called Lipari. Today I'm gonna explore another island called Stromboli, which is actually just a big volcano. I got my ticket to Stromboli and the ship is about to come. I think it's over there. The trip is like two hours. Just arrived a small village called Genostra, which is on the island of Stromboli. You can see the volcano on my back, which is super amazing, and the weather is not officially you need a guide to climb on this thing. But I don't need a guide, obviously. There is a trail which goes all the way on the top of the volcano. Then I can go to Stromboli village and take the ferry back to Libri. I got three liters of water and lots of candies and stuff uh, from this beautiful store. And this is actually the local church. Here is how the way look like, a trail in between Cacti. Finally I'm out of the village, it's super calm here, there is absolutely zero people, which is so great compared to other islands like Lipari. This looks like a good place for the break, um, Volcano is still far away. I just arrived to 400 meters, there is a sign that the access to the upper places are regulated by something. But there is no explicit indication that I cannot walk further. So you can see the actual volcano being in the cloud. I'm in the cloud, everything is wet, it's 750 meters and you can see those two things which are kind of shelter against the volcano eruptions. Here's supposed to be the view on something, but as you can see, uh, <laughs> it's a view on the cloud. So I'm gonna keep walking. Quite a standard volcanic trail in the middle of nowhere. You're walking on the sand. This is almost the highest point. It's still in cloud, plus you have some toxic fumes in here. <coughs> so you can feel it's breathing. It's not like your normal Oh my gosh. Okay, you see this? This thingy? These are not clouds. Okay guys, safety is first. So to avoid the smell, you just need to walk slightly down from the ridge. It's like, I wonder why there is no one. It's such a beautiful area. <laughs> so many clouds. Oh, unfortunately, I have only two and a half hours before my ferry, so I have to go really, really, really fast. And as you might have guessed, there is no cloud over there. It's such a bummer. I'm back from the cloud to real life. You can see the whole Stromboli. Couple of last final steps on the volcano. And it's normal grass. I'm back to the road and it's almost Stromboli. I think there is a place with some coffee and stuff. I got my tickets back to Lipari and here is the local beach. There is nothing going on. Actually now the cloud pattern is not as bad as it used to be, so I believe you could see something when you are there. I would have waited for this if there was additional ferry back to Lipari. I'm ready to get my dinner. So this is the restaurant, it's called Epulea. Epulera. And I'm getting inside, hopefully they will let me in. Here is a small starter. Appetizer time. The local antipasto. I 
this is the main dish, which is big fish, and the soup. It looks so cute. This was definitely the best dinner. Don't forget to like my videos and subscribe to my vlog over here.